It's been nearly two months since two levees breached in Levesey, Missouri, leaving the entire city underwater. There's still plenty of cleanup and work left to be done after the historic flooding. This week, FEMA was in Jackson County helping flood victims get federal aid. Today, volunteers came out to help a local church that was affected. 41 Action News reporter Nick Starling is joining us live in Levesey with the latest. Nick, still cleaning up. They are, Dia, and that flood has devastated this small community. One of the pillars is this church, and volunteers try to salvage what they can because they say if they can save this church, they can save the town. We got all the pews out of here. Pastor Jeannie Lisher shows us what's left of her church. So we've been working on drywall in these little rooms back here, um, furnace room and storage rooms. Ten inches of water rushed into the Ebenezer United Church of Christ on June 1st. Nearly two months later... The cleanup process still in effect as about 30 volunteers took out drywall and get the mold out of this church. It's pretty devastating because uh, flood leaves a mark. I mean, and it's a mark that's full of decay. It's full of mold. It's full of a lot of things. Next door, the pastor's house also a victim of the flood as about two inches of water forced her out. It's just devastating. It, it's just heartbreaking. This is what Levesey looked like in June. Water overtopping roads, seeping through train tracks and surrounding houses. Today, the lack of water cracks the soil in this once flooded farmland, showing the wrath of Mother Nature. It's a flood many hope never happens again. Ultimate fear is once it floods, it'll flood again. And FEMA has been in this community many times, and many people who live in Levesey tell me it's been a great help. Now, as for this church, it's unclear whether or not they will rebuild here or rebuild in another part of Levesey. Reporting live, Nick Starling, 41 Action News.